Hereford Volunteer Ambulance Association was incorporated in 1953 right here in Hereford and it was founded by several community members who felt the need for an ambulance service here in town. We've been able to continue that heritage and that tradition on for the last 65 years. And being a member here really makes me feel the value of that mission that those founders started out to meet. The founding members of this organization wanted to be able to help every single person they came in touch with. And that, I believe, is why we are still here. We're able to help people whenever they need us. And we're able to provide that service with members of the community to members of the community. I love the station. Um, the, the, the station here at Hereford is great. I mean, we have such a tight-knit um, family of, of responders, and that's one of the benefits of Hereford uh, in particular, is that it's a, uh, it's, a, it's a more rural station, it's tighter-knit, and you get people that are really passionate about the community. Um, and so from any level of training, from the very, very newest recruits all the way up to the, uh, the station chief himself, uh, you get people who are really passionate um, about their community, and that really leads into uh, how people interact with each other here at the station. I enjoy hanging out at the station and spending time with our volunteers and our paid staff both. I enjoy um, learning from their knowledge and um, getting some of their expertise and I appreciate how they really have taken me under their wing and coached me. Hanging around the station is always a fun time. Um, you get to know who you're going to be riding with very well. Um, it's pretty much like a brother-sisterhood. Uh, responding to calls is a little nerve-wracking at first, but you always have so much help and I'm never afraid to ask questions on the ambulance. For me, responding on a 911 emergency is not knowing exactly what's going to happen until you get there. It's kind of a surprise every time. You know, they can tell you that you're going for a particular call, but until you get there and you talk to the patient, you really don't know what's going to go on. If you knew everything, it wouldn't be as exciting. To me, that's the fun part, not knowing. You want to make sure that you're prepared and that you can really reflect on all the knowledge that you've gained in all of your experience and all of your classes that you've taken to get you ready for this moment right now. And you want to make sure that you're doing the best for your patient. And But once you're on scene and you have, you know you can trust your crew and your friends, and it's, it's relaxing, honestly. For me, I've absolutely loved responding. Um, it's been great. One of the things I love most about Hereford Ambulance is that we have everybody. And when I say everybody, I mean people with 30 years of healthcare experience, CEOs, doctors, lawyers. We also have the 16 or 18 year old high school and college students. We have moms, we have dads, we have community members with all walks of life and all kinds of experience in healthcare or no experience at all. And they're able to come together in this organization for one common purpose, to put an ambulance on the street in this community. Being a member here doesn't just include uh, running 911 calls, we also need help with fundraisers like the Pit B fundraiser, office work, and other administrative tasks. If responding to calls is not your forte, we do not need all of our members to respond to 911 calls. We need all kinds of members here at Hereford Ambulance. We need members who can help us with our fundraising, we need members who can help us with bookkeeping. Again, you don't have to be an active writing member, an EMT, or a paramedic to be a very valuable member here at Hereford. HVA needs all kinds of volunteers. We have administrative positions available, we have volunteer EMT positions available for all different levels of training. We could use the, any help that we could possibly get and your service in the office, your service in the administration, as well as your service in the field is equally valuable. The trainings here at Hereford Volunteer Ambulance are offered at no cost to our members and they're in a variety of disciplines, both in specifically emergency medical services, other emergency disciplines, and also things in management and leadership. And one of the reasons I continue is the length of service award program that we have. If you're a member of a participating company like Care for Volunteer EMS, after 25 years of credible service, when you reach a certain age, I believe it's 69 now, you actually receive a small retirement-like check for the rest of your life. It's not a huge check, but it's something. Another advantage to being a volunteer with, with Hereford Volunteer Ambulance Company is a state tax credit that the state of Maryland gives you for participating as a volunteer. Running an EMS station is not cheap. Even though we have some volunteer members, um, our equipment and our station is expensive. We need help and we need community donations to keep running and keep providing the service. Though our operation is subsidized by the Baltimore County government, most of our purchases and most of our expenses are actually covered by community donations and through our fund drive and other forms of contributions from community members and community businesses. 
our latest defibrillator purchase through Baltimore County was over $18,000. Our latest ambulance purchase, again assisted through Baltimore County, was over $300,000. Now, like I said, we get assistance from Baltimore County with these things, but we have to keep them up. We're responsible for the maintenance. We're responsible for restocking them um, and getting them back out the door. And that, that takes money. You know, plus we have to pay the regular bills at the station, TV, telephone, heat. So every penny is, is worth it to us. Uh, as a uh, life member here at Hereford, I've been doing this for three decades now. Uh, it's gone from being something that was fun in the beginning to something that's been incredibly rewarding for me and has led to a, a career in the paid fire department so that I'm able to make a living doing something I love doing. Uh, I would certainly encourage anyone who's interested in either emergency medicine, uh, in volunteerism in general, in firefighting, get involved in your communities, do something you know, with your time. Uh, it's an amazing reward to be able to give back to the community and to go on calls that have an amazing impact on people's lives. Volunteering at Hereford Ambulance is one of the best decisions I've ever made. If you have any interest in volunteering in your community, I encourage you to visit our website, our Facebook page, or stop by our station, meet some of our members, get a tour, and find out how you can help us put our ambulance on the street in your community today.